Let's go through application for the one-handed topspin backhand. Um, right, right now we have four juniors from our program that play a two-handed backhand. But as we said, they're visual demonstrators. We've taught them to teach. We have one of the older players in the program who's going to be the teacher. And they're going to follow the lead. Say, for example, if this was a tennis camp setting. Um, Connor should be able to teach Emmanuel, Nicola, Shannon, and Rachel. Um, in the back, we have a visiting coach status from Greece. And it, it's great to have professionals come over and our students can teach them. So let's do this. Uh, Connor, if you'd come up to the front cone. Everybody, set your racket down. Set your racket down. And you're going to stand in the position I'm in right now. Okay, you're going to just pivot in this position, like you're a soldier and you're going to march this way, just pivot. Okay, copy me, me, you're up on your toe, very good. Now from the ready position again, you're going to pivot. Now the back knee bends as you step out, you're going to step straight to the net, step straight to the net, stay there. Now come up on your back toe and you're going to stay sideways, sideways. Remember now you're hitting one handed, you're going to be totally sideways, totally sideways. Shannon, totally sideways. Okay, very good. Now. From here, we're going to do it where we're going to sit in the chair, ready position, the imaginary chair. You're going to pivot. All right, now the back knee bends, sit in the chair. Now you're going to synchronize the lift and the turn, but you stay sideways at the hit. All right, very good. Now with your arms, copy me, you're going to pivot. It's going to be hand to hand, forms a line, and then hold it like this. Stay right there, stay there. Your head is down, you're looking forward. Your arms form a line. All your weight's forward to the point where your trailing hip is higher, okay, where you're way out in front. Your head should be in front of your stepping foot. Lean in. All right, very good. Now pick up your racket, if you would. Touch the edge of the racket to your nose. Butt of the racket to your belly button. Okay, you're going to put the racket in your right hand. Okay, now you're right-handed. Put your right arm behind your back. You're creating the throw to the racket, index finger on the strings. Now turn for a... Uh, Forehand volley like me, a left-handed forehand volley. Put the racket in your other hand, Nicola. Very good. Now from here, you're going to turn further. Now on a one-handed backhand, you get more than sideways to stay sideways. Turn even more. Now put your grip on the racket. Hold that position. Your grip is on the right side of one. You're looking over your shoulder. Okay. Your arm is relatively straight. It's not hyperextended. All right. Very good. Now when you go down, go ahead, step straight ahead, Nicola, the racket face tilts. Now show me the closed position and copy Connor. All the way down, the racket's going to be in this position, okay? Now from here you go inside out, away from your body. And then now just go up, like this. Now stay there, and the racket's like an archway in this position, okay? Now your, your body's open like you're hitting two-handed. You've got to be sideways. All right, now the follow through is on the same side as the contact point. All right now, let's do this. Everybody, watch uh, what I'm going to do with Connor's cone. You're going to do the same. Just set your racket like this. Now, ideally, we'd like to see the racket be straight up and down, but for now, that's fine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stand away from it. I'm going to reach down. I'm going to grab the racket. Now, the racket's on edge like this. My knuckle faces up to the sky and I just go this way. Okay, let me see everybody do that exercise. Just application, you're sideways, and then do it again, over and over again. Just set the racket down. You're going to get low and go up. Tennis is a game of hitting straight line shots in that position. Okay, now, you're going to set a cherry on the ice cream cone. Now from here, watch, I'll do it first, Connor can do it second. You're just going to observe initially. I'm going to do three things. I'm going to turn, change my grip, straighten my arm. I really coil. I coil so much, my arm's against my body. Now the racket face goes down. When the racket face is closed, then and only then can I swing inside out. And I'm going to go like this. I'm not going to hit orange, I'm just going to hit yellow. And I'm going to go up like this and be on balance. And then it's a matter of just repeat, repeat, repeat. Now let's watch Connor. Thanks, Emmanuel. Now, he's away from the cone. Ready position. He makes a pivot. Turns. Arms on the inside. Pushes that left hand way down. Sits in the chair. Lifts up. 
holds it. Okay, now Connor's going to be the spotter. Go ahead and all, all of you can do it. All right, you're not hitting the ball. So those of you that are in the back, you can still hit the ball forward. We could have the players in the back turn and hit towards the fence, but it doesn't matter for right now because they're not hitting the ball hard. Very good. Okay, now what we want Connor to do is hands not in his pocket. He's going to be totally engaged. He needs to come by, check the grip, position the student, tell him to hold their position. He needs to teach. All right, now go ahead and switch places. Shannon, you're up here. Hi, Nicola, you're up here. All right, so Connor needs to go to this first, this person first, do he man well, and then he needs to go over here. He, needs, he would need to say rotate and take command of the court. Go ahead. And then go up, stay there, do it again. Hit and hold. Okay, now keep working on that. Now keep in mind you get them to choke up on the racket and they can just toss the ball out in front and then they start to hit. They can hit like this where their partner is going to catch it and they hit back to them. But they're on their way to being able to teach a one-handed backhand. This will really help their two-hander just going through this because the mechanics are so much the same. Let me see Rachel. Okay, continuing working on a top spin backhand. We're going to have the player stay sideways. We're going to make sure they don't have a big backswing. They're going to understand the vertical contact point and the grip that will set the racket in this position. Their partner is going to toss to them. And they're going to go up straight line like this and have the archway. So let's have Emmanuel, Rachel come over, stay sideways, put your arm right over the net like that, stand sideways Emmanuel, sideways Rachel. See, toss and catch, why don't we do four and switch. And if it's on two bounces, that's fine. Now move like an athlete, two hands. Really interesting to give people directives and see if they do it. Two hands, be an athlete, make the catch. Okay, up, up, up. And then you can adjust your feet slightly, that's it. And now you can switch. And they should notice that they're hitting topspin by brushing up this way, they're hitting top. Okay, sideways, check out your grip. Be able to hit right to them. Okay, two hands, two hands on the catch. Toss and up, arms straight. Very good, uh, your two-handers are staying sideways. Okay, let's have everybody other side of the net, please. Take your racket with you. Shannon, you're on the service line, please. Nicola, you're on the service line. Emmanuel, Rachel on the baseline, and running the entire time. Ready, position. We're gonna go slow, we're gonna play statue. When, I, when Shannon's hitting the ball, Emmanuel, you're shadow swinging. Same thing, Rachel, for Nicola. Ready, turn. Index finger on the strings. Look over your shoulder. Turn more, Emmanuel. Turn more. Okay, now hit and hold. Hand to hand forms a line. And go up. And on this side, excellent. Turn the body more. Turn the body more. Don't open up. Belly button stays to the side. All right, rotate again. Now, certainly we want to give them two or three hits at, the, at, the, at their turn up on the service line. Okay, ready position. Index finger on the strings. You're a one-hander right now. Turn. Now we have these players every day drop hit one-handed underspin backhands. So Shannon, you're going to shadow swing, ATA, air of the armpit. You can make the adjustment steps. It's a lifting game. Turn your body more. Turn your body more. And lift. If you're going to miss, miss big. Lift. Excellent. All right, switch again. All right, now we'll have two hits. Manuel, ready position. I'm talking to the row. The player's in the back row. Turn more, turn more. Let me see, Rachel. Turn. Okay, hit. And hold it till I come back. Stay there, Emmanuel. Hold it till I come back. Hit. And hold. Stay there. Excellent. Ready position, Shannon. You're going to turn. Look over your shoulder, Emmanuel. Rachel, turn. Hit. Hold. Stay there till I come back. All right, right here. Looking over your arm. You're going to hit. And hold. Excellent. Very good. Switch places. Emmanuel, you didn't get on that front foot, though. You will this time. Here you go, Nicola. Ready position, turn. Show me your back. Now you're gonna swing away from your body. It's like the hood of a car. Excellent, right there. And some of you are so young you don't know that later on you may want to change to one-handed backhand. Ready position, 
especially you, Emmanuel, because you love to come to the net. It's a great transition shot to be playing a one-handed backhand. And right here again, hit and go up. All right, again, everybody, ready position, repeat. Okay, to be bored is to insult one's own intelligence. Ready position, turn for the one-handed backhand. Okay, now go down to the slide, go down the racket in the closed position and lift up. All right, very good. Okay, let's get a couple balls up. On the run, go, three and three. Continuing with the topspin backhand. Obviously, we want to get to the point where we incorporate movement. Let's do this first. Now, a topspin backhand. Connor, come out, shadow swing, topspin, one-handed. Okay, now let's come back, do it where you're on the move. Okay, ready, hit and go. Hit, now hold, now hit, hold, stay there. All right, next player up. Okay, ready, go out there, topspin, one-handed. Stay there. All right, look forward, again, go. Change the grip, turn. All right, topspin, topspin. So it's lifting, again, go. Okay, now to prove a point, these are all two-handed players. Let's now have them hit underspin. They're gonna lead in with the bottom edge of the racket. They're gonna go slightly down and back up. Okay, underspin. All right, hit and hold, and hold it. Very good, next player. Ready, turn. And next player, excellent, we're on the way. Hit and hold. Okay, Shannon, go. Breathe out at the hit. Here you go, flatter at the hit, Nicola. Don't swipe down. Excellent, much better. Okay, now, I want Connor to come out here and toss the ball. So set your racket down. Emmanuel, you're here, okay? Two girls on the end, Shannon and Nicola. They're going to hit backhands off the cone. So now we have some more movement here, and you're going to hit it towards the fence. And Status has been here. Now he knows the checkpoints, and very quickly with our simple system, he can be ready to help out. So you're not going to wait like that. You're going to wait like a tennis player. So go to the middle. He wasn't ready, okay? Stop, back. You're over here. He was not ready. Connor didn't have eye contact. All right, he wasn't ready, so next thing you know, it's going to be like this, okay? He's going to get eye contact. He's going to toss the ball right on a dime. He's going to hit, and he's going to hold. Okay, go ahead. Very good. Over and over again. Up. So we incorporate movement. Tennis is a running game. That's all right. You, you have that same wrist problem on your two-hander. Leave the wrist alone. Swing with your arm from your shoulder. Way up, a rainbow over the net. Okay, very good. Let's have you switch. One more, Emmanuel, lift. All right, Emmanuel, great backhand. Sh Nicola, you're up here. Shannon, you're up here. Let me hit one, please. You're gonna turn. Let me see if I can hit it. I'm gonna get underneath and go up in that position. Stay sideways and lift. Go ahead, Nicola. Breathe out at the hit, higher of the net. If you're gonna miss, miss long. Don't turn your back to the net, ever. Don't turn your back to the net when you get back in line. Okay, there you go, movement. Up, up, up. Close the racket face. It's the same as your two-hander. Let those knuckles tilt down. And again, this is a good way to practice the two-hander. That's a backhand. There you go. And Rachel working. Okay, let's see the status. You got Emmanuel going. And those are some ideas that have application to teach the one-handed backhand.